So far this year, South Korea's energy imports have soared by more than 85 percent, with oil and gas prices at historic highs, both because of recovering demand and supply disruptions because of Russia's invasion of Ukraine. All of Korea's oil is imported. It's been enough to turn the country's trade balance to a deficit, and consumers are taking a direct hit. Min Soo Kyun reports. South Korea is spending more on its energy imports this year. According to the Korea Customs Service on Monday, imports of oil, natural gas and coal between January 1st and March 20th stood at 38.5 billion U.S. dollars, up 85.4 percent from a year earlier. Crude oil rose nearly 70 percent on-year, while natural gas surged 92 percent and coal jumped more than 150 percent. The rise in energy imports was mostly attributed to an increase in global commodity prices following the global economic recovery from the pandemic, as well as Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Russia is one of the largest producers of oil and natural gas, accounting for about 12 percent of the world's crude oil and around 70 percent of its natural gas. Market watchers say that soaring energy prices are not only believed to squeeze the profits of local companies, but are also expected to burden the country's overall trade balance and consumer prices. If the prices of imported goods rise, the total cost of imports increases, and this will negatively affect the country's current account. Also, there's a possibility that high import prices will add to inflationary pressure. As of March 20th, South Korea so far posted a trade deficit of 5.98 billion U.S. dollars, a sharp shift from a 6.7 billion dollar trade surplus recorded over the same period last year. Meanwhile, in February, consumer prices hit 3.7 percent, growing more than 3 percent for the fifth consecutive month. Min Suk Kyun, Arirang News.